Hey, what's up guys? Brought you the Julia Prison over here in Illinois. Thank you for uh, Sean Cody actually hooking us up with his location. This is Sean Cody. What's up everyone? All right, make sure you guys uh, subscribe to his channel and also check him out if you guys uh, would like. Also, make sure you hit that like button, comment below if you have seen anything, and also share it out if you can for me, please. I gladly appreciate it. Make sure you, if you haven't subscribed, make sure you subscribe. Also, I have some special guests here. John for Exploration Unknown. What's up? Josh for Southern Afterlife. What's up, guys? And you guys already seen Sean Cody. All right, guys. I hope you guys enjoy this. security building all right um, I'm gonna try to do a couple part series here um, crunch for time but I'm gonna do it I'm gonna try to get bring it out for you guys uh, like I said we're gonna here in the maximum security area this is death row um, this building so we're gonna check it out let's go all right guys this is the first jail cell ever built here this used to be standalone by itself here it's crazy just to see one little cell that was in this whole property when this was first built. It was built, I don't know if you guys can see that, 1853. This is nuts. They didn't even provide with a bathroom or anything like that, it looks like. It's crazy. Just imagine being in this jail cell. That's all you could do. Look, look, I'm, let me show you. This is how wide it is. My shoulders are, are touching. That's all you had. Wow, that is nuts. That's all you had was that. And it was exposed to the outside elements the whole time you're in here. And there's open field, just imagine being in an open field and just this little building holding you in there. That's crazy. All right, these are the old solitary prison cells. Okay. Oh, that's Josh. Okay. I thought we were getting activity already. I guess that goes up to the second floor. Let's go into one of these cells. Oh, look at this, guys. I guess this is a restraint chair. They used to restrain them. And then I guess they were acting up in solitary. It almost looks like an electric chair. But there's restraints, you can tell. Wow, that's nuts. They used to use a belt to hold people in there. Look, they used to hold cameras, I guess. This thing looks like cameras back in the days they used to set up there. Yeah, that's pretty cool. All right hear other people talking and there's a number of us here so you're probably gonna run across other people like um, uh, Lakeshore Exploration ex Lakeshore Explorer Exploration or something Lakeshore Haunting or something like that it was I'll get that right I'll put it in the description everybody that you can see in this video I'm gonna put it in the uh, description so this is where they used to sleep to to a bunk in here some high ceilings and toilet. 
That's all that was here. Like I said, I apologize if you hear uh, other people talking in the video. They're in other areas talking, and, you know, doing their videos just like we're doing right now. So, hope you guys enjoyed this. It's pretty good. It's pretty awesome being here. That's how they used to look out. The little piece of glass. there. I feel real tight in the chest right now. Real tight in the chest right now. Creepy. I don't know if you guys can see that in there. Oh, there's a different bed here. You still have this one in here only. Like I said, guys, if you do see something that I don't catch on editing, because sometimes I don't catch it, sometimes I see it on editing, I'll leave it there for you guys to watch and catch it because I like you guys getting involved in the comments. So if I'm talking too much, I'm sorry. I'm just, I took some monsters. <laughs> I like her. All right, guys, we're going to go explore this um, solita solitary confinement. We're going to go upstairs. I'm by myself. Everybody's outside. Just to make it authentic, you know? So we're gonna go upstairs. I'm gonna turn this light around. I can't see. Alright. Just imagine coming up here. If you were a tall guy, you would be squatting down. Because I am 5'10 and look how close the ceiling is to me. <clears throat> this is creepy. Just imagine being locked up in these cells back in the days. All right, guys, let's pause right here. There's three knocks on this. This is the first knock. I had to enhance the audio to hear it. Just listen. I get a cold chill right here, right now. I got the hairs in the back of my neck standing up right now in here. All right, guys, this is the second knock, number two. I swear to God, I'm feeling cold right now.
All right, this is knock number three. Let's listen. What was that? Yeah, I'm a dead serious. I feel cold presence back there in that corner. Like right now, I'm warmer. I'm heading towards this way. I got that freaking crazy feeling like someone's here. Look, right now, right now, I'm starting to get cold chills. Just imagine all these cells full and having to look through that low glass looking out. I don't want to go too much inside the rooms because of the paint peeling. And I don't want to get exposed to any, uh, that's a shower. It's a shower. Exposed to any lead paint or anything like that. Cause it's all pulling away. It's, I guess it's the shower. Yeah, this is a shower head. The shower head's way up there. because I feel uneasy up here right now. Josh heard him say something like, who's there, what's up, or something like that. Uh, you gotta watch his video to check that out. But I'm, like I said, I'm dead, dead serious. This corner was creepy. It's creepy. It's crazy. So, we're gonna do a spirit box? Or echo box? We're gonna do the echo box. both heard something. Listen again. Okay, is there anyone in here with us? You can speak into this box with a light on it and we can hear you. Can you tell me your name? Philip, you sound like Philip. I heard Philip, yeah, Philip. Hello, Philip. Are you the only one here with us tonight? How many of you are here? 
It's not like five. Are you a prisoner here, Philip? Did you say my name? It's not like Carlos. It's not like Carlos. Do you know Carlos? Does sound like no. Or is one of your names Carlos? That's right. That's right. So someone else says Carlos. My name is Carlos also. That's weird. Yeah, yeah. I said that's weird. Yeah, so Carlos. Let me introduce you to Carlos. How you doing, Carlos? He responded. I can't what he said. It, it sounded like you're welcome. And it's every time it's that same voice, the one that said Carlos. Yeah. Thank you for speaking with us, Carlos. Were you a prisoner here? I was. I was. How long were you here? Sound like 20. 20? Sound like 20 of them. I said 20. I, I, did you hear that? Yeah, it responded. Wow. I thought it said a lot. I said 20. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Do you like talking to us? It just shush you. It just shush you. Yeah. Likes you, John. Do you do you enjoy speaking with us? Are we upsetting you being here? No. Nope. What did you do to be put in here? Say murder. Yeah, that's what it sounded like. It's a, it was this Yes. Yes. Oh man, I just got chills. Look at this. So so. So, it's, it's cold over here. It is. It's cold. So, Carlos, you said you're here for murder. Was it in self defense? Can you answer one more time? Was it in self defense or did you do it on purpose? Sound like yes. Which, which part? Did you do it on purpose? No. So it was self defense? It just said self defense, I believe. Yeah, that's what it sounded like. But it was like whisper. So do you feel like it was wrong that you were put here? Yeah. Yeah. I'm sorry to hear that. I hate that, Carlos. I understand it was self-defense. I would have done the same thing probably if someone was attacking me. I'm sure you didn't mean to do it. Does anyone else want to speak with us? It did say Sean. Do you know Sean? Or is your name? Is your name Sean? It's a Carlos again. So, no. His name's not Sean. It's Carlos. So, do you know Sean standing here beside me? Say that again? We couldn't hear you. Can you repeat it? Yeah. 
Yes. Yes. You know me? So you, now you know Sean. Yeah, Sean invited us here. Is it just because I've been here several times? I know. Is it, I know. I know. Hi. Yeah. Hi. Hello. Who was that? What's your name? Philip. Bro. As we were talking about this, something bright went across those holes. Really? Yeah. I think the camera got it. You take the camera got it? Yeah. Guys, go check this out on this channel. Yeah, definitely. Out. Definitely check that out. So, does Carlos, can we speak to Philip now? No, he said no. Why can't we speak to Philip? Did he just say bad? Say what? Bad. It's, is Philip bad? Is Philip bad? That's what it sound like. That's what it sound like. Oh my god. Wow. I've never heard it say bad before. I never heard it. He said he's doing life. He's doing the. What did Philip do? Sound, sound like murder, right? Well, I heard a woman. Just yeah, I heard a woman. Yeah. Came on and said, I, I'm speculating, but probably killed a woman. Probably. Died, and, you know what I mean? I don't want to say it on camera. But, yeah. yeah. I'll take it home, bro. I'm all right. I'm nervous, Rick. <laughs> I'm good, bro. I'm good. I'm, good. I'm not moving back. So Philip's a bad person. Is he is he gonna to try to hurt us? Yes. That was that's not like Philip coming for me. Who whispered in my ear? I Can you talk one at a time, please? I felt like something was touching my shoulder, my, yeah. my freaking back of my arm. Who touched Carlos? I just felt like, you know when someone grabs the back of your shirt and goes like that and tugs on it? I, what did it say? I, I sent to Carlos. Yeah. Is anyone in here going to try to hurt us? They've been saying my name a lot today. Heard this. Heard this. Who's gonna hurt us? Philip. Can you move something in this room? Did he just say leave? He yeah. said leave, then now. What's going to happen if we don't leave? I think he said ask Sean. He knows. Sean? No. I don't know what happened. What jail cell were you in? Did you hear that? Yeah, I heard.
heard that. It said mall. Yeah. There's a mall. There's a mall that's going around us. It said mall. Where are you at? We can't see you. Show yourself. What jail cell were you in? What number? speaking to us right now. Does it sounds like sunny. So sunny. Is your name? So Sonny, how long were you here? What were you here for? Did you say your name? Yeah, I said his name. So you want to give Josh a turn? Yeah. It said Josh and it said John. Sorry, I'm paranoid with that hole. <laughs> I know, I'm just making yeah, sure. Right? Like it's cool, there's cool air that's not really around here. Sonny, are you still here? Can you please touch that green light on the floor? Somebody please touch that green light that's on the floor. You say how? All you gotta do is get close to it. If you touch that green light, then let us know you're there. All right, guys. We did a hell of an investigation here. We got a lot of, a lot of uh, messages through the spirit box. Um, Josh has, it. and um, we also, I had an experience up here, um, and Josh also had an experience up here. Uh, make sure you check out his channel, and also check out uh, John's channel also, because, like I said, we all came up here different times and walked alone inside this building. It's pretty crazy. Hope you guys enjoy it. Until next time. Part one. Done.